The D man. Yeah, shout out my nigga from D's Media. You feel me? <laughs> Yo, it's your boy D's Media back again with another video. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel on the road to 100K. Today, we're going to talk about Yo Gotti making his first public appearance since the death of his brother, Big Jook. Um, 42 Doug throwing a two-day concert in Detroit. Uh, the first day is um, 42 Doug and Friends is Yo, Yo Gotti, Meek Mill, Glorilla, ESTG, Black Youngster, and more. Um... Yo Gotti showed up, as we can see on the screen, you know, he performed, you know, he gave a good show. Um, a lot of people didn't expect Yo Gotti to show up, you know, because his brother, like I said, was recently shot and killed in East Memphis. But Yo Gotti showed up to the D, he rocked that thing. As you can tell from the screen, Yo Gotti got a bulletproof vest on because Gotti built, but he ain't built like that. But at this point, I can understand why he got to move militant. You know, he can't take no chances. He don't know who in Detroit is uh, PRE fans or anything. And like I say, you know, this concert has been public. Uh, you know, the the time, the event, the location has been public for at least about a week or two. So, you know, Gotti can't afford to take no chances. Um, but as you can see, you know, Gotti showed up. He did his thing. He rocked the show. Um, appreciate uh, all the artists that came out to my city, Detroit, and show love, man. We need more events like this. Um, but like I say, I wish Yo Gotti and his family, you know, uh, my condolences go out to them. Um, I don't, I could never imagine what it feel like to lose a brother. I got two brothers myself, and I can only imagine what it feel like to lose a brother. But uh, we're not gonna play crazy, you know. When you want to be uh, 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 cocaine music, and you want to be in these streets, and you rumored to be involved in. You know, young Dolph Death and your brother allegedly put a hundred thousand dollar or forty thousand dollar bonnie on young Dolph head. You know, uh, certain stuff gonna come with it. You know, um, I don't wish violence or death on anybody, but I also do know when you part of this street life, I know what comes with it. Like I tell you all the time in my videos, there's three type of dudes. There's sidewalk dudes, there are porch dudes, and there's street dudes. You're not going to get treated like a porch or a sidewalk dude once you're in those streets. And that's just what it is. You know, that's why I try to tell the kids, man, find what you're good at, pursue it hard, put your dedication in it, give it give it your all. And I'm telling you, whatever you want to be in life, man, you could do it. You don't have to give your life to a gang. You don't have to give your life to the streets. You don't have to give your life up. To, to to senseless violence if you choose not to. Whatever you want in life, man, you can work for it. The problem that we have today is, is everybody want it fast, quick, in a hurry. Nothing's going to come overnight. Don't matter what it is. Um, um, don't matter. You can't... Apple wasn't built in, in a day. Amazon wasn't built in a day. Uh, Netflix wasn't built in a day. The, you know, all this stuff, it takes time to build. Nobody just came out and instantly was successful and became a millionaire. And if they was, look how fast they're going to lose it. But I know I'm getting a little bit off track. But uh, 42 Doug threw a concert, uh, 42 Doug and Friends concert in Detroit. And like I said, Yo Gotti showed up. This is his first time showing up in public. Uh, you know, he hasn't spoke or commented on his brother's death. So, you know, this was good to see Yo Gotti talk. He gave a little speech, you know. He shot out all the dope boys across the world. Uh, he shot out all the real niggas across the world. But uh, like I say, uh, you know, this is the first public appearance since Yo Gotti's brother death. He still hasn't spoke on his um, his brother death. But at least to show that he's still getting to the money, that's a good sign, man. Because when you lose a relative, only thing you could do is live for them, man, and keep going, man. Remember, man, never give up in life. And I'm going to tell y'all kids again, whatever you want to be in life, you could do it. All it takes is hard work, dedication, and a good drive and good focus. But it's your boy D's Media signing out. But I'm going to say it again. This is Joe Gotti first. First public appearance since the death of his brother, Big Jook. And he rocked the show, man. Love Detroit, man. We got to do more concerts like this.